Welcome to Wearable Wednesday, folks. Today we're walking around in Soho testing out our GPS jacket made with the Flora. Flora works great with outerwear projects because the fabric is thicker and you don't have to wash the garment as much. Uh, Phil programmed hints to light up when we get to the Apple Store. All right, so we're here at the Apple Store and my jacket's blinking. Now this is either a warning to others, stay away. There's no, there's Apple stuff here. Um, or it's a beacon to go inside. I happen to really like new iMacs, so I'm gonna go inside and check out the iMacs. Thank goodness my jacket told me that I was here. All right, see ya. <laughs> this project uses the Flora GPS as well as the color-changing NeoPixels. And we'll begin by affixing the Flora to the jacket with snaps. This can be quite handy for quickly removing your flora for use in multiple projects and you can learn all about it in this previous episode right here. For all of you mobile users, the video links are in the description below. The pixels up around the collar require three connections to the flora. Power, ground, and signal attached to D6 on the flora board. And so I've stitched all of those lines with conductive thread up to the collar area using a basic running stitch. You can learn more about using conductive thread in my tips and tricks video and also the tutorial on the Adafruit learning system. Test out your first pixel before adding seven more along the chain around the collar. And head over to GitHub to download the code for this project where you'll also find the libraries for the pixels and the Flora GPS module. If your battery is connected, turn the onboard switch to the off position and plug in your USB cable to program your Flora. It's a good idea to test each part of the circuit independently before using code that combines them. So for example, I'd run the sample code for the pixels here, then run the sample code for the GPS to verify that they're both working, and then run the code for this project, the jacket, that combines the two elements. I tucked a 3x AAA battery holder in the pocket and also chose to make my GPS snappy. Tyler and I wrote a complete guide for this project, showing you how to update the coordinates with a certain range so that next time you get to your destination, you really make an entrance. Thanks so much for watching. I hope we've inspired you to build your own wearables project and uh, that you'll add it to the Adafruit Flickr pool or join our weekly show and tell on Google+. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel here on YouTube.